hey, chue de, chue de Muganda wange, it's been confirmed Jose Chameleon is landing a private chopper in Uganda. Wait, is he going to be the first artist to own a private chopper in Uganda? Or there are other artists who have private choppers right here? Anyway, I'm going to be giving you the details about this story, but the chopper is landing anytime from now, and the chopper is written on Dr. Jose Chameleon, Uganda. Ah! <laughs> anyway, subscribe to the Buzz UG and don't forget to hit the bell for all the notifications. Uh, my name is Fula, and by the way, happy 59th Independence Day, Uganda. We love you, motherland, and we really pray for nothing but a peaceful transition of power in Uganda. That is from a Mr. Tibbs or Tibuhaburwa to the big man in Magere, the ghetto gladiator. I'm talking about Bobby Wine. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Shall say, shall die, shall say, shall die. Neda, neda. Anyway, uh, going to the story, uh, it's been confirmed Jose Chameleon is landing a private jet anytime now in Uganda. Guys, this is serious news. I am not kidding. I'm not joking. Jose Chameleon is landing a private jet anytime now in Uganda. We all know that uh, it's just a few weeks after Jose Chameleon received a Range Rover that left everyone talking and that was after Chameleon knelt down thanking President Museveni's brother Mr. Toyota for the gift. Uh, and, and very many people were saying that uh, gifting Jose Chameleon with the car wouldn't be the problem but the problem was kneeling down. That was uh, two weeks back. That was the biggest talk. Now, if someone said Jose Chameleon is lucky, actually, I wouldn't say no to that because his opportunities are piling day after day. This is after it's been confirmed that he's already warming up to receiving a helicopter. Chameleon received a lot of criticism from Uganda. We all know that. I think that was uh, two weeks back after he knelt for the car. Ugandans claimed that uh, Jose Chameleon is too big to kneel down. We saw very many big celebrities right here in Uganda coming out to be like Jose Chameleon. Uh, this one you did wasn't right. You cannot kneel down for a car. I mean, you're too big. I mean, you're a legend. How do you kneel down for a car? Anyway, now, I know some of you are asking yourself, where is the helicopter coming from? Who is gifting uh, Jose Chameleon with a helicopter? Is it President Museveni? Is it again Mr. Toyota, President Museveni's uh, brother? You know, uh, who, who exactly is giving Jose Chameleon a helicopter? Now, let me tell you, Jose Chameleon recently confirmed to the journalist that uh, one of his Kenyan friends uh, promised to gift him with a helicopter. Now, I want to tell you exactly what Jose Chameleon said in his own words. People are angry that I was given a car, but I'm afraid they are going to visit their ancestors once I get other good things. A friend of mine in Kenya promised to give me a helicopter. Now, Jose Chameleon goes on to say, imagine what will happen on social media. I'm in talks with authorities at Kajasi Airstrip, and once we agree, I'll get it. Yes, there you go. Words of uh, Dr. Jose Chameleon uh, confirming to us that anytime now, the helicopter is arriving right here in Uganda, particularly at the Kajasi airstrip. So, Jose Chameleon has actually confirmed it. And uh, my question is, is he going to be the first Ugandan artist to own a chopper? Maybe they have been there before. But right now, I don't know anyone, any Ugandan celebrity musician who has a private chopper. So... I think for now he's going to be the very first person. But I also heard that Bobby Wine's fans are planning to purchase for him a chopper as well. So personally, I just can't wait for what is coming in the nearby future because the future is really smiling. Uganda is really going to be amazing, especially on social media. When you know that uh, Jose Chameleon has a chopper, Bobby Wine has a chopper. And then where is Bebe Cool? Bebe Cool, what will he be doing? Eh? What will Bebe Cool be doing at that time when the two has choppers? <laughs> anyway, that is the latest from uh, Jose Chameleon's camp. Uh, I don't know if we should start congratulating him right now or we should first wait for it to arrive in Uganda so that we can start congratulating him. But for me, I think it's okay to congratulate him. Yeah, so congratulations, Jose Chameleon, and uh, we really wish you all the best. So, guys, kindly subscribe to the Buzz UG just in case you haven't subscribed. And don't forget to hit the bell for all the notifications. My good name is Fuller. Thank you.